You had the chance to be part of this team last year, obviously unable to play because of transferring over from Middle Tennessee. But how important was that to have the opportunity to be part of this program, learn the team, learn the coaches, learn the culture? Um, I think it was good because when I transferred at Christmas, um, you know, they were already halfway into conference. So it was – I kind of got a late start. So it was good to kind of work my way in, get to know everyone, kind of get comfortable with everyone. So, you know, it wasn't just like I transferred and, you know, I'm thrown out there. So I had a little bit of time to move, move in slowly. How has the adjustment this year, obviously with all the protocols and, and COVID and trying to adjust to practices and eventually playing games, how has that personally gone for you? Um, it's weird, for sure. It's definitely weird, but I'm getting the hang of it. It's, it's kind of like the new normal now, so it's, it is what it is. You know, we want to do whatever we have to do to be able to play, to be able to start on November 25th and get it going. So you played in this building a few years ago, right, with, yep. with Middle Tennessee. I believe that was a Golden Eagle women's basketball victory. I think you had 10 points in that game, though, mm -hmm. double digits. What do you remember most from that game? Um, what I remember most, and I told everyone this when I came here, is I just remember when I walked in the gym, you could just feel the vibe of their team. You could feel how determined they were, how, um, how much energy they had. And, I mean, it was almost intimidating coming in because you could, you know, they were ready to go, and it was just – it was kind of fun to see how they played together, how they, you could tell how much they loved playing together. And it, you know, something that after I decided to transfer was something I wanted to be a part of.